This is Steve Weissman, and I'm the Principal Consultant, Analyst, and Trainer here at Holly Group, where best practices for content process and information management is our bag. I'm here today to walk you through my top seven mantras for process and information betterment, a series of reminders that I've gleaned over more than 20 years in the business, and they're downloadable for free in the form of a small poster that you can print and hang up as a daily guidepost. I'll have that link for you in just a few minutes, but for now, let's begin. The first mantra is one that I've been using since the mid-1990s. It's psychology, not technology. This is a phrase I use to focus attention on the fact that nothing has a greater effect on a system's ultimate success than your people do. Another way to put it is that the soft stuff is the hard stuff, meaning that people are a whole lot squishier to deal with than configuration codes are. The corollary to this is that change management equals parenting because both share a foundation in getting people to do things that you know is good for them, but they really just don't want to do. Clean your room, eat your vegetables, tag your content. You get the idea. The second bit is that there's more to value than just money. The ability to affect process change and improve collaboration is equally critical so that, as we put it, you can ensure your people work better and work better together. This is also true for your various systems, and to me, this represents a holism that's at the center of any effort to derive maximum total value from your information solutions. The third is the notion that the planning is the work. Information management technology today can be so effective that there's a real temptation to charge into projects without spending enough time to determine precisely what you need the technology to do. As a result, organizations are often left with the feeling that it simply didn't work and a lot of finger-pointing between business managers and IT staff. And how could it not? Because if you don't know where you're going, you can't know when you get there. The fourth mantra is, don't take yes for an answer. When you ask a vendor, service provider, consultant, or other potential partner whether a solution can do a certain thing, they'll almost always tell you yes. But some won't necessarily tell you right away that getting it to do that thing requires the purchase of an add-on module for X thousands more dollars, or having someone at your office full-time for six months, or something like that. So don't just take their yes as an answer and walk away. Instead, say, yes, how? And watch the fun begin. Number five is to know when to say when. Like a guy with a plate full of steaks, organizations sometimes forget that there's such a thing as the law of diminishing returns and that continuing to invest at the same rate in a particular course of action may not return a commensurate amount of satisfaction. Here, the guiding principle should be that good enough is good enough, after which it may be time to move on to something else, like dessert. Our sixth mantra is Jack be nimble, which we use to remind clients that rapidly responding to changing business dynamics is critical. Information infrastructures, therefore, must be designed and built to readily accommodate change, be it more traffic, more users, a greater variety of formats to be handled, whatever. Because if you don't, your competitors probably will, and then I fall back to Charles Darwin and adapt his famous saying to talk about the survival of the fastest. Finally, there's the matter of the triple threat of politics, baggage, and religion, a threesome that brings us back to where we started, psychology because they're all steeped in human behavior. The politics of turf battles and budget control, the baggage of pre-existing skill sets amongst your people, or good or bad experiences in prior situations, or the religion of only using Microsoft ever, or never using Microsoft because. Logic often doesn't have a place here, rather it's all a reflection of human behavior. And so, now we've come full circle. And there you have it, seven mantras for process and information betterment. Now, I know it's hard to copy and display an online video, so I've gone ahead and prepared a small poster that you can use to remind yourself of the ideas that we've just talked about. It's free, and to get it, all you have to do is go to the special link that's on the screen here and tell me who you are. I'll read it to you in case you want to focus on writing it down. Ready? It's hollygroup.com slash h slash mantras. And like I said, it's free, and it's all just part of the service. Thanks very much for watching, and do let me know what you think. 
My contact information is shown here, and I'm always glad to read your comments, answer your questions, or otherwise have a conversation. My name is Steve Weissman, and I approve this message. <laughs>